with the investment team, we view ourselves as owners of enterprise. As such, we are looking around the world without any constraint for quality companies that are trading at attractive valuations. Therefore, uh, we have no constraints by country, sector, market cap or index. We also have no constraints to be fully invested. When we do not find attractive investment opportunities with great valuations, we are perfectly willing to keep cash, diversify cash into, into short-term government bonds, until the market offers us more attractive valuation opportunities. Finally, we also tend to keep a structural position in gold and gold-rated securities that we view as a potential portfolio insurance policy against extreme and unpredictable market events. We seek first and foremost to preserve, at minimum, and if possible to enhance, the purchasing power of our wealth and of our clients' capital over time. To achieve this goal, we will only invest in companies with an appropriate margin of safety, a discount that will enable us to protect our investments against the uncertainty of the future and against our own mistakes. We also focus on avoiding capital loss by not investing in companies with high valuations, with a lot of leverage, business models that we do not understand. We keep a very diversified portfolio with no single exposure above 2-3% to in equities. We keep cash when we don't find investment opportunities and we maintain gold as a structural insurance policy against extreme and unpredictable market events. All this allows us to have a very prudent approach to preserve wealth over time. First Eagle Ammonia International Fund typically offers a very diversified and very balanced portfolio structure. We have around 100 to 160 stocks in average or historically in the portfolio. We don't have any equity exposure with more than 3% today. We are invested around the world in all continents in small, mid and large cap companies. And typically the portfolio structure will evolve on the cash side according to opportunities in the market. In 2009, for example, we had almost a fully invested portfolio as equity markets were very attractive valued. Today, we have a rather defensive portfolio structure as we're finding less opportunities at attractive valuations. The investment manager of First Eagle Ammonia International Fund is our long-term partner based in New York, First Eagle Investment Management. First Eagle is a family office with over 200 years of history. The global value team is in charge of managing this fund. It is composed of 20 highly experienced investment professionals with three portfolio managers, Matthew McLennan being the head of the global value team, but also Abbe Despande and Kimball Broker. We have two senior advisors with Jean-Marie Veillard, the founder of the strategy, and Bruce Greenwald, a very uh, experienced economist from the Business School of Columbia, New York. We also have 12 entirely de dedicated analysts only working on this strategy and free traders also dedicated to the fund. Overall, this team is managing today roughly $86 billion under this investment philosophy. We view First Eagle Ammonia International Fund as a core long-term wealth management solution. Core because it's a very diversified, very stable, very easy to understand and predictable behavior type of fund. Long term because this is how we manage our wealth over the long term. We are perfectly willing to underperform equity markets over the short term if we can achieve our goal of preserving wealth over time. Typically this fund will underperform in fast rising markets or in bubble type of environments. However, by accepting short-term underperformance, typically we will be able to generate very attractive risk-adjusted returns over the long term. With the investment team, we exactly share the same interests like our clients. We invest our money in the strategy, so our main objective is to minimize the risk of permanent impairment of capital over time. To achieve this goal, we always invest with an appropriate margin of safety by always focusing on what could go wrong, by implementing very conservative valuation criteria, having a very diversified portfolio, keeping gold as a potential insurance policy, and having cash 
if opportunities become more seldom. This very prudent approach has enabled us to achieve very attractive long-term risk-adjusted returns uh, by always generating positive performance over five years, by consistently outperforming MSCI World over five-year periods as well.